My name is Ross Mandel, and welcome to my show today. Baby, baby, baby. <laughs> That's the kind of show it's going to be. I'm coming to you live from Mammoth Studios in Boca Raton, Florida. We're coming to you uncut, unedited, uncensored, unfiltered, and some people were shocked today to find out <laughs> that I am under arrest. I just got to say, hey, and what a beautiful, beautiful day I've had so far today. I'm uh, traveling around with a good friend of mine, keeping me company. I had the privilege of going to uh, an AA meeting, uh, my noon meeting here in Boca Raton, Florida. Anniversaries this month. Some of you have tuned in and you're aware. Some of you don't care. But to me, baby, can you see this? This is a 20-year recovery chip. 20 years, let me say. You don't even get a watch in AA. <laughs> you don't get a check. You don't get a pension. You get a chip. And you get a chance to start again every day. What a beautiful, beautiful thing. And if there's one thing I can say after 20 years, a room of recovery, it's like magic. It's magic. A bunch of people that are damaged and hurt and uh, are suffering, many in pain, uh, coming together and getting well. It is one of the most beautiful experiences that you can you can have on God's earth. And and I gotta say that, wow! I can't believe I gotta wait another whole year <laughs> to celebrate again. Oh my! Now, let me just tell you that. Uh, you know, there's an expression, be careful what you wish for, because you're going to get it. And now what are you going to do? And I have been saying over and over and over, my name is Ross Mandel. I'm on Facebook. That's Ross Mandel, double S and double L. I have a website, RossMandel.com. My email, my personal email is Ross at RossMandel.com. I want your feedback, your thoughts. I want the good and I want the bad. Even the ugly. And guess what? You guys have been feeling... <laughs> you guys have been cooperating. Oh, no. I mean, last night, I spent hours, hours and hours responding personally to each and every comment, each and every thought. Some of you are complaining. Many of you are giving me very good advice. And I have to say, you know, what an education I've gotten. Because, you know, as you know, this week, I brought up the God word. Yes, Ross Mandel firmly and truly believes in God. Well, you know, they say when they advise you in the media, even at a, 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 a dinner or a, a social party, an event, you know, two things you never talk about. <laughs> you never talk about religion and you never talk about politics. Well, politics is comedy. That's comedy in this country. But the God thing, let me tell you, some of you have come out and you're asking questions, tough questions, and I love it. And you're giving me your thoughts and your comments. And, ho, oh, you know, it's like a real can of worms. But I promise I will continue to respond to each and everything until I can't. And that's that. For now, I'm doing it and I'm, I'm working at it and I'm giving you everything I got couple of quick comments, uh, a little feedback to you to respond to, <laughs> to some of your funny questions. Uh, no, I do not mass produce these webcasts. I don't come into the studio and bang out six or seven in a day. I know some of you think I do. You see, I have 30 of these simple black t-shirts. They, they come in packs of three. It's produced by Calvin Klein. I wear an XL or a double XL in case you wanted to know. And frankly, I wear jeans, sneakers, and a, a black t-shirt almost every day. Too bad. If you don't like it, <laughs> you got it. <laughs> Fuck you. This is my broadcast. But in all sincerity, there was only one time I actually recorded two of these podcasts on the same day. And we have yet to release one of them. And by the way, those were 30-minute podcasts. So, you know, you haven't seen them, and I'm telling you. So that's, that's the story. Now, let's talk quickly about God, okay? 
to me, God is God. He's the king of all kings. He's the creator of the universe. He's everything, okay? And uh, someone said to me, uh, is uh, your God the God of the Bible? Which Bible, okay? You know, mankind, throughout mankind's history, we've had a number of Bibles. You know, someone wanted to say the King James Version, you know, reproduced in 1611, blah, blah, blah. My God is the God of all Bibles. You know, my God has chosen to communicate with me personally. It's an intimate thing. He talks to me. I talk back. There is a lot of cursing involved. You know, what can I say? This is my story. You know, this is my experience. And I apologize if yours is different. One thing I can tell you, I respect and I admire anyone and everyone that has a belief in a greater power, in a higher power, in a God. Either a loving, caring God, a trusting God, or an angry God. And you've seen them all if you read the books. You've seen them all. The story of Noah. I mean, what do you want me to tell you? You've seen them all. The God of my understanding is my God. He's the king of all kings, of all Bibles. And uh, that's who I am, and it means a lot to me. And I, he doesn't judge me so much on words, of course, unless I'm trying to be hurtful or abusive. Somebody pointed that out to me. That's not the case. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Now, I want to say that... Uh, Today's Friday, okay? It's October, I think, the 29th, Halloween Sunday, the 31st, Halloween night. I'll be doing a, uh, a special uh, live radio show. A good friend of mine uh, in the Midwest is putting me on a show, and I'm happy to do it. And more importantly, it's important for me now to start letting you know that a week from tonight, November the 5th, on Friday night at 10 o'clock, Eastern Standard Time, EST. <laughs> I'll be on True TV's Conspiracy Theory with your host, Jesse Ventura. Jesse the Body Ventura. Jesse the movie star, the athlete. Jesse was the governor of the great state of Minnesota for four years. And uh, he still likes to be referred to as the governor. And I don't blame him. Frankly, I'd rather they call me the body than the governor, but, you know, I haven't been there. So, you know, that's, that's my experience. It's going to be a shocking, a shocking performance. I think that people's eyes are going to go wide open. I think you're going to find it compelling and revealing and fascinating. It's really great stuff. Friday night, November the 5th, True TV. It starts at 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. It's called Conspiracy Theory. Jesse Ventura, Ross Mandel will be featured on that show. You don't want to miss that. What can I say? This has been a crazy week. I mean, Charlie Sheen, let me just tell you. I've been reading in the papers about the whole thing. I mean, an allergic reaction. Some of you are so funny out there. You know, uh, some woman wrote to me, how could you have an allergic reaction to a hookup? <laughs> I know what some of you guys are thinking. Of course we have. But, no, <laughs> I'm just saying, beautiful girl, 22 years old. I mean, she came from the Bronx. That's where my wife comes from. And uh, good kid, Irish kid. She goes out to L.A. when she's 16, 17, starts a life in porn. Does a lot of lesbian porn. What do we say, fellas? There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> stunning girl. What was more stunning was that, uh, you know, Charlie owes her $12,000. And she wants that $12,000. <laughs> that seems to be her fee. Twelve grand. No wonder why Charlie was throwing chairs at her. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I think it's pretty funny. I mean, 12 grand. I mean, there's some magic going on in that room, wouldn't you say? Coupled with the $7,000 in damage, the half a million dollars now in legal and uh, PR fees, 
you know, thank God Charlie gets a million eight an episode. Well, that was a really, really revealing week as far as I'm concerned. You know, we had the Charlie Sheen matter. We had the God thing. Let me just tell you. Ho, ho. This is an explosive topic. And uh, I know why nobody wants to address it. Nobody. I mean, you know, I'm really thinking next week we're going to talk about... We're going to talk about abortion. We're going to talk about right to life. Let's get crazy, everybody. These are topics that nobody wants to address. And I'm starting to get why. But it doesn't mean anything to me because you're getting me live, uncut, uncensored, unfiltered. It's unedited. And oh, yeah, I am still under arrest. I want to wish everybody a great weekend. I want to wish everybody a happy Halloween. Happy, happy, happy. You know, if you got kids, this is this is like their Super Bowl Sunday. I mean, my favorite my favorite event of the year when I was a kid was Halloween, was trick or treating, knocking on doors, people just giving you candy. What a nice thing that is. You get to put on all kinds of funny costumes. You get to go to parties. Your parents are nice to you. The neighbors are loving and giving. Or they just, you know, leave the candy out front of the door and pretend like, you know, they're not around. But uh, I want you to have a great weekend, a happy Halloween. And I want you to remember November 5th, Friday night, Jesse Ventura, Ross Vandell, 10 p.m. True TV. What a privilege it's been to chat with you guys today and this week. And this is just another clean black t-shirt. And I'm wearing true religion jeans, freshly washed. So I don't want you to think I'm recycling my clothes or I'm mass producing anything. I wish I had that ability. Everybody, you have a great, great night. Have a great, great weekend. And I will see you next week with more live, uncut, and uncensored. Thank you.